Hello guys. Well, now I am going to explain you why a ball reverses when the ball is old. Or you can say why a ball reverses or moves in the opposite direction when one side of the ball is shiny and other side of the ball is lighter and rough. Okay. Now the reason behind this is the reverse swing bowling genuinely depends on the weight of the ball. Okay. So when one side of the ball is lighter, or you can say when one side of the ball is rough you can see the one side of the ball is rough and other side of the ball is shiny and that means this side of the ball is heavier when it is compared with this side okay so when you want to push the ball away from the batsman magically it moves into the batsman okay now this is the reverse swing so how it happens so this is the swing this is the grip which we use for the out swinging delivery for a conventional swing bowling so when you are trying to push the ball away from the batsman it moves magically into the batsman i mean when the shiny side of the ball is faced towards the batsman well the reason behind this is when it moves fastly in the air what happens is the air travels the coming air travels more fastly or the amount of air travels more on the lighter part of the ball which means on the left side which makes the ball to push in opposite direction which is the heavier side okay this is the reason why the ball reverses or you can say why the ball is pushed in opposite direction well i can give you i, I mean i can give you another general example i mean which is which cannot be a, which cannot be a, or which may be a, a scientific example well when a plane when a plane moves faster in the air which has two wings left and right when left wing is broken what happens it obviously it moves towards the opposite side i mean when the left wing of a plane is broken it moves towards the right side because we, the right side is heavier than the left side of the plane okay this is the same phenomena which can be used well of course this is not a scientific comparison but it can be compared with this phenomena i mean in the context of reverse swing bowling so at the end of the day what happens is the air clearly pushes i mean the the amount of air travels more towards the lighter part of the ball in fact the lesser weight it travels towards the lighter part of the ball and pushes the heavier part in opposite direction in this video you can see very clearly the heavier side or shiny side of the ball is on right side facing towards the batsman on the other hand the lighter part or you can say the rougher part of the ball is on left side facing towards the extra cover region therefore since the right side of the ball is heavier and left side of the ball is lighter obviously the large amount of air will travel towards the lighter side which actually pushes the heavier side or in fact you can say pushes the shiny side of the ball in opposite or reverse direction moving in the air into the batsman finally at the end of the day you got to understand that or you can see here clearly the ball with the seam position facing towards slip region will be pushed outside the off stumps just like as we do in conventional out swinger but magically it just reverses or moves oppositely in the air into the right handed batsman hope you have understood the concept of i mean the reason behind the why the ball actually reverses or moves oppositely when the ball is pushed in other direction i mean when the ball is pushed 
to one side and it moves the other direction. So this is what is all about the concept of reverse swing bowling. And you can say why the reverse swing happens. Hope you have understood. Meet you in the next video. Goodbye.